Hi guys, this is Katrina and I'd like to welcome you back to my channel if you're an old time subscriber and I'd like to say welcome if you are new here. And if you are new here, go ahead and hit that subscribe button down below. Don't forget to hit the little bell so you'll be notified of all the videos that I upload in the future. So let's just go ahead and get into the video. video I just wanted to share with you guys some of the natural hair products that I have purchased in the past couple of months and um, this is another reason why you want to make sure that you are subscribed because I will be doing reviews on these products um, so you don't want to miss that so the first product I'm going to show you is by Melanin Hair Care and it is their African Black Soap Reviving Shampoo and this is what that looks like there and I'm pretty sure that you have seen this all over YouTube and Instagram, but I have used this a couple of times already. Well, actually I've used this one time. My daughter has used it one time. So I am very excited to share with you guys my thoughts on this African Black Soap Shampoo. And also I purchased the Multi-Use Softening Leave-In Conditioner. Now, I have recently done a review on this leave-in conditioner. I'll have it linked up above in the, in the description box so you can check that out. But I did really enjoy this, so I did purchase another one. And the first time she launched her oil, I did not purchase it, but I've heard really great things about it, so I did purchase it this time. And as you can see, like I have been using it, um, so the second thing that I purchased and actually purchased these two products from Ulta, um, I purchased the Design Essentials Natural. Um, it's their Almond and Avocado Anti-Frizz Curl Defining Gel. And this is what it looks like. And as you can see, it is like a light brown color. Um, I thought this, at first I thought this was kind of like their curl forming custard but it did not say that on the um but it did not say it on this bottle so you know i was like okay it has to be different because it's not the same name it kind of does like look the same like the same color if i remember correctly um but you know the name says differently so i was like i'm gonna go ahead and purchase that and try it out so the next product I purchased was by Design Essentials as well, and it is the leave-in conditioner from the Almond and Avocado line too. And I have tried this leave-in conditioner before and I really, really liked it. And I actually have like maybe a bottle and a half of this leave-in conditioner, but I thought it was different because of the um, packaging is different. So, um, and then I thought to myself, I was like, maybe I'll just take it back. But then on the other hand, I was like, I might as well just keep it because I really did enjoy this leave-in conditioner when I tried it. Um, so yeah, I'm just gonna hang on to that. And so the next thing I purchased was from Honey's Handmade. It is their Yucca Mango Honey Growth Thickening Hair Lotion. It is made with organic yucca extract and this is what that looks like and they were having like this special like if you buy a t-shirt then you get this free and um so this is the t-shirt that they had for you to purchase and as you can see it says naturally dope and um but yeah i thought it was worth it because this product is like twenty dollars on their website if i'm not mistaken so, you know, hey, you know, why not? And I was interested in trying this thickening hair lotion anyway. So we shall see how I like this. So the next item I purchased was from Henna Souk. And if you're not sure what Henna Souk is, it is a place where you can get these Ayurvedic herbs to grow, thicken, and strengthen your natural hair by using the Ayurvedic herbs. I have been using the Ayurvedic scalp and root hair mask and the peppermint co-wash that they have. So the product that I purchased recently is the 
Sweet Honey Enriching Hair Nourisher. And this is what it looks like. And this is what the consistency looks like. And it kind of looks like it is honey and it's really dark and it is kind of sticky as well. Um, but yeah, this Sweet Honey um, Hair Nourisher, it includes such ingredients as raw honey, organic vegetable glycerin, organic sunflower oil, extra virgin olive oil, organic castor oil, um, and all these other natural products and herbs. And I just wanted to try it because when I looked on the website, like it had really, really great reviews. And actually, I think it has like over 100 reviews and it has um, five stars. So I am really looking forward to see how these Ayurvedic herbs grow my hair and thicken it. And I think I've been using this for about a little over a month now. So I am excited to see, you know, the changes in my hair. So the last products I received were in my curl box and they are by Afro Sheen. And this is the Afro Sheen Crown Defining Curl Cream. And this is what that looks like. It doesn't have like a really distinct or overbearing smell or anything. It smells okay. So the next product that came in the curl box is the Afro Sheen Lush Fro Butter. And this is what that looks like. And this product is like a very like, it kind of reminds me of like a pomade. And I'm pretty sure that like that is probably good for like twist outs or braid outs, if I'm not mistaken. So the next product I got in the curl box is the Fro Out Blow Out Spray. And this is what that looks like. And I probably won't be using this anytime soon because I don't plan on like blowing out my hair or straightening it anymore this year. I think the last time that I blew it out was to get my um, my knotless braids and that was in July and then I've already and then I straightened my hair for my birthday which was in March so um, yeah I'm probably not going to be doing any blowouts or straightening my hair anymore this year so I don't know maybe I'll find somebody to give it to and then lastly this is the glow up shine spray and this says that it finishes and adds shine and it came packaged in this nice little Ziploc bag here. Um, but this is what that looks like. As you can see, the packaging is kind of, you know, cool looking. Like, hmm. I'm not sure like what that is for. Do y'all see that little piece right there? I don't know. But anywho, it's the Glow Up Shine Spray. So that is pretty much it for this video. I just wanted to share with you guys some products that I have purchased recently. Um, comment down below if you've tried any of these products and what your thoughts were. Um, and also, if you have not subscribed to my channel by now, I mean, you might as well. You made it all the way to the end of this video. Please go ahead and hit that subscribe button. Hit the bell so that you'll be notified when I do upload another video. And I just want to thank you guys for watching and I will see you guys in the next video. Bye.